Everyone is different in their own way. Eating food and exercising daily are things that vary from person to person. Some people have very strict meal plans or count their calories throughout the day. Other people tend to eat when they feel hungry. Then we have people that choose to exercise daily while others are not able to exercise or choose not to be active. Each person is different in their own way, but we can each be categorized into one of the three somatotypes. Somatotypes is a concept created by William H. Sheldon in the 1940s and has been used by physicians and dietitians ever since. The three biotypes include ectomorphs, endomorphs, and mesomorphs. A person can be classified into one of these categories, but can show some characteristics for another. The first somatotype to be informed about would be the ectomorphs. These are considered to be long and lean people with little to no body fat. These are the people who have trouble gaining weight no matter how much they eat. The next bias style would be endomorphs. These people are able to gain a lot of body fat along with muscle very easily. These people tend to gain weight effortlessly, but do not necessarily mean they're overweight. They do have a larger amount of body fat, which creates them more susceptible to lifestyle-related diseases. The last body type would be mesomorphs. These are athletic, solid people who also tend to be strong. This type of person can eat what they want without worrying too much about it. They gain and lose weight without much effort. These types of people have high metabolism that is constantly working. These biotypes are not set in stone. A person could have characteristics of one or more of these biotypes. The best way to find out for yourself is by applying some of the diet and training regimens for each of the biotypes and see what that program does for you. Understanding what to eat and when to eat is crucial. If you are lacking knowledge of this, then proceed to the next video.